Hello friends, in this video we are going to see about Occluder, Plano Lens, Red and Green Filter and Steno Pick Slit. First we are going to see about Occluder. Occluder is an opaque disc. Opaque means light rays are blocked in the opaque medium. When Occluder placed in front of our eye, the light rays unable to pass into our eye. If we need to examine one eye means, another eye should be occluded with the occluder. For example, if we need to examine the right eye means, the left eye should be occluded with the occluder. On placing the occluder in one eye, it breaks the fusion and it helps to relax the accommodation. Usually, we see an object with the help of our two eyes, but it forms a single image. So, the brain's ability to gather information received from each eye separately and forms a single unified image is called fusion. Accommodation means our eye changes refractive power by altering the shape of lens in order to focus objects at variable distance. The image displayed in this slide is the image of occluder. Next, Plano lens. Plano lens has no power. It is used to find the person who is malingering. Malingering means the person who have a clear vision but they say they can feel a blurred vision, they can't see the letters clearly. But by placing the Plano lens, they say that they can feel a clear vision, the letters are clear now. But Plano lens usually don't have any power. By this we can identify the person who is malingering. Next, Steno pick slit. The image displayed in this slide is the image of Steno pick slit. Look at the image, it has a slit of 0.5 to 1 mm thickness. The length of the slit is usually around 20 mm. When we place a steno pick slit in front of our eye, it allows thin strip of light rays into the eye. Steno pick slit used to find axis of the cylinder and also used to find whether the patient has astigmatism. It is used to perform the m Fincham test. M slave Fincham test used to find whether the color the halos arise from cataract or from glaucoma. Next to red and green filter, the image displayed in this slide is the red and green filter. Red filter is placed in front of right eye and the green filter is placed in front of the left eye. Red filter allow only red color to enter into our eye. Green filter allow only green color to enter into our eye. It is used for color dissociation and also used in performing testers like what for dot test and the friend test. It is used to find suppression, diplopia, squint and also measure fusion. Diplopia means double vision, squint means crossed eye that means the eyeball alignment is abnormal. When a person experiences double vision, to overcome this double vision, he or she usually suppress one eye to avoid the double vision. Suppression usually leads to amblyopia. This is the definition of suppression. I hope this content is helpful for you. If you like this content means like the video. Leave your opinion in the comment section. If you think this video is helpful for your friends means share this video to your friends. For regular optometry updates subscribe the channel optom A to Z.